फिर कुछ कुछ त्रिम तो बोलो नमो वित्रा गाय नमो 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 लोए ऐसो पंच नमुकारो भगवते वासुदेवाय ओम नमो शिवाय ओम नम शिवाय जय सचिदानंद जय सचिदानंद जय सचिदानंद ओके तस्वी लेट्स डू द प्रेयर या ओ दादा भगवान Please give me infinite inner strength, such that I will never compromise on health, so that my body, as an instrument, will always be helpful to me in accomplishing my life goal of study and satsang. I will always, I will remain absolutely sincere in studies. I will always stay away from bad company and bad habits. And whatever happens, please shower your divine grace and blessings, such that I would never ever miss my satsang. May I use my mind, speech, body, instrument, and soul that is all my resources to oblige others, which is the best religion. I will always remain sincere, more and pure in my speech and body, in all my dealings with self and everyone in life, so that I become a man of personality, par excellence, exactly like Dada Bhagwan. Jai Satchidan. Jai Satchidan. Very good. So, what did you pray? Anybody? Okay, it does me. Uh, I pray that um, whatever happens, I will always like stay healthy. I'll not like eat junk food or like not do exercise so that anything harm comes to my body. Second, I'll always remain sincere in study so that I can, you know, um, be successful in life. I can become what I want to be and like achieve my dreams. And then third is uh, staying staying sincere to satsang so that you know you understand Dada's nyan and then you can follow like use it in your daily life. So that you can reach the goal of being a pers- man of personality and power and person like Dada Bhagwan. Very good. So, how many times sincere word comes in there? A couple of times more, right? Yeah. So, what does sincere mean, Kush? It's like if you say if you say like I want to do this one thing for like every single day. For example, if you want to be sincere in studies, like you say that. I want to um do um study every day at least like one hour to be sincere in it. It means to do that every day, like at one hour every single day, and don't forget it. Like don't forget it. If you forget it, then that doesn't mean that that means that you're not sincere. So. Okay, Dhruvi. Why are you mute and why am I see horses? We don't want to see Can horses. I... We want to see people. Okay, Can you please repeat? Ruby. He said, "What does sincere mean?" Uh, it means like if you want to be sincere in health, you like focus eating in everything. If someone gives you something, you eat it because it's healthy for you. And if you like say no, I don't want to eat it, and it's like some kind of a snack or something, then you're not being sincere because you're not you don't care about you're not like being. How do you care? Help. Okay. So, Deepak Dada, what is sincerity really mean? Sincerity truly means whatever you have decided, you stick onto that, and you never fail to do that. And that's what 
and that sincerity truly means actually you are honest to your decision. You remain honest to your decision. Okay. No compromise. No compromise. And no because your decision is so strong and firm, that sincerity will definitely, uh, you'll be there. You'll be sincere to that. Okay. So, but how and where does sincerity start? Anybody? First, anybody? No, hold on. Yeah, okay, okay, go ahead. Anybody? Push. It starts in studies. No. Sincerity starts with studies? Health. Health? No, how does sincerity start? When you decide I want to be When sincere. you decide, yeah. Huh? What's that? When you decide to do something, ah. that's when sincerity starts. All right, you got it. Now, so what? So decide. So what the other words for decide mean? Any other words wow. you can use? That's it. That's it. You choose to do something. Ah, yeah. Okay. Keep on going. Uh, you make a decision. Decision comes after something. When you want to do something. What What is it called? Uh, and a decision. That's you, you, you tell me the same thing. <laughs> To say Every, okay. everything starts from a G O A L. A goal, okay. Without a girl, how are you going to be sincere? Yeah. Right? Yeah. Oh, everything starts from goal. Like waking up in the morning. I want to wake up, I don't want to wake. You know, what was your goal? You want to study, I don't yeah. want to study. I have weaknesses. But what happened to the goal and weaknesses? You got that? When you have a goal, your weaknesses like kind of go away. Because you work hard to any, accomplish the goal. Anything you have to have a goal. Otherwise, nothing will get done. Yeah. Like, like you, you have to, to study, but you're feeling lazy. The goal is to, to study, but you're feeling lazy and say, oh, I'll do after two hours. Then you won't do it anytime. You're going to go like, uh, not now, later, later. And then you're, no, no. at is the that, end time, you're going to have to rush. Is that sincerity? No. Importance was go study or le being lazy and try to force around. Study. Yeah. So that is very, very, ultimately, you see always everything more than that. So talking about goals now, so you understand, right? That is why yeah. we have three goals you children can look up to and be sincere yeah. to. That is why we didn't have 10, 20 goals. Three is, is manageable and it encompasses the whole things we do. We will be doing, you know, till we die. Yeah. You know, instead of studies, it will come to profession. You know, eating is always going to be there. The other book ones, spirituality, a food for mind is always going to be there, right? So the only yeah. three will become the wholesome person. So talking about yeah. it, so let's now focus on the weaknesses. Okay, it does. Oh, my weaknesses, uh, during the week I can wake up early, 
but on weekends I wake up late and then say like when you have holidays I wake up late I can't wake up like early at seven so oh. and then yeah, go uh, and then like I try to do exercise but the thing is I feel lazy and then I don't do it so I end up just compromising on my health most of the times unless I actually just go for training or go to school then I don't so let's take the first one waking up every weekend versus weekday so in the weekend you feel you want to rest a little bit more does that conflict, yeah. is that a conflict with your goal of doing anything that particular day no not really not really but something is getting missed right by taking extra two hours of sleep no yeah but yeah, you could study and other things you know you could do all the prayers and stuff in those two hours yeah so these are these are the logic you have to use you know to achieve the goal you want to achieve okay kush what about you Yeah, same thing. When there's holidays, um, I can't. I wake up a little later. I want to have some extra rest, since we don't have to like do any, don't have to attend anything so much mostly. So no, I'll wake like one hour late. You had more. Well, yeah, I did. Um, another one was. Look it up. Where can I? You have to write this I down. I don't. I don't have my device, so I wrote it down in the other thing. Yeah, but you have to write this down because you know we're going to work on this weaknesses. Well, and one is that, like when I study, I do all of it. Like I don't do extra. I do as much. Like if my dad says write like um a, like one essay, I'll write that much. I wouldn't add anything else. I wouldn't do anything extra. I would just do that much. So. Right. Another thing is you don't don't like to read and write. Yeah. Okay. So, are these all good qualities to reach your goal? No. Okay. So, as long as you understand that, now you pick one. Forget about waking up. As long as you you have older children, you wake up for school. Uh, we won't touch that right now, but take the second yeah. goal and let's work on that. Keeping mind and goal and sincerity for the whole week. Okay. Yeah. So, Tashwi, what will you pick? I will pick doing exercise in the morning before I go to school. Okay. Coach. Um, I'm gonna pick my um, I'm gonna pick my second one. I have to um, practice like reading and writing. Okay. Okay. Uh, Dhruvi, Devam. Yes. What is your weakness? Number two. Number two weakness. I don't put things at the right place. Okay. So you what? Uh, what is your goal? Three goals of life. No, 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 no. The goal about this weakness. What's your goal to get rid of this weakness? What do you want to do so that like your weakness goes away? So you want to start putting things in the right place, or it doesn't matter. Yes, I start putting things at the right place. Why? You want to please yourself, mama, papa, right? Yes. Okay. So, let us work on that. Okay. I know you're working in other places, but for this session, just pick one and do it. Druvi. So I wanna fix the 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 weakness. Um, I feel bored when I do social studies sometimes, cause like 
So I'm gonna fix that. I'm gonna practice more social studies and be really like focused in that. I don't know. I could be a good Dada, did you hear any, what you said? Please talk about social studies. Okay, yeah, that was the next topic. So, Deepak Dada, tell her how can you be interested in social studies? Uh, first of all, I'll talk a bit about your holiday schedule and your regular work day or regular day schedule. I believe don't keep a different schedule. Your wake up time should be fixed as far as possible. So for you, your holidays are more important and you will put more to get more from the free time you have. Because in the free time, you have a choice to do whatever you want to do and make the best of the free time. Uh, it's like you have the choice to use your time and you will do the best, you will make the best use of your time, which is very important. So first is that. Any subject, uh, do you like social studies? I Please. like it, but yes, yeah, I, I like. like. And how, how much do you like uh, compared to other subjects? Like if I compare to math, it's a little less, but I like it. So this is where you have to identify that why you are weak in social studies. Because there is some factor of dislike, some factor of uh, uh, less interest. She said but she gets bored. Come again? You feel bored? Yeah, she gets bored when she does it. Yeah, so now, uh, if you try to understand what is basically social studies, then you will understand that that science of living together and make that society worth living because you, nobody is live alone. You live alone with family, with friends. You need people to, to live along with. And if you don't have that vision of kind of socialism, not that socialism, but how to live socially cordially with all in the in a society. And you make the best in the society. You contribute so much in the society to bring people together with oneness. This is a very large goal, wide spectrum goal, you can say, but then what we must understand is the importance of that subject, the importance of knowing social study. And how many years you have to study that? All your life? Yeah. No. Practically all your life, but in your subject, in your school, maybe two or three years, maybe four years, that's it. Because once you go to the college, I believe many subjects, get cancelled. You are not needed to learn them. But in the school, you have opportunity to know that subject, to have an opening, an idea about that subject. Isn't that important? Yeah. So <clears throat> you take that as an important information and always say that I like that, I want to know that and uh, ask for that inner strength from Dada Bhagwan that you fare good in the subject. So just with that, tell yourself repeatedly, like every day, uh, you can keep a time before you start your day, you remind yourself that I like social studies a lot and I will do good in that. I'll get good grades, Dada give me that inner strength. Just this much you say for yourself and everything will change. Apart from that, if you don't like the subject, then I believe you don't get good grades in that subject also. Is that so? Yeah. You don't get good marks in that subject. Yes.
And with that bad marks, that one subject and bad marks, your overall grade falls down. Correct? Yeah. So yes. You, I believe you don't want to mess around with your grades. So what is the best way? Just whenever you don't find something interesting, then tell yourself, repeat yourself that I like the subject. I will do good in the subject. I'll get good grades. Dada, give me that inner strength. Just this okay. much. Two minutes prayer, okay. not even less than one minute prayer. But yes. when you remind yourself like this, your mind will change. Your attitude will change for the subject. And that inner liking will naturally make you, help you remember the things, what you read, what you study in that subject. And naturally, yes. you get grades. Okay? Okay. So, uh, Dhruvi, that's your homework, okay? Okay. So, uh, Hitesu, how come you you like all subjects? Well, how come you're not like uh, Dhruvi? Uh, I don't know. I just enjoy learning about the subjects. And like now, I just have to choose four subjects that I want to study. So, I choose the one I like. So. Yeah, but before I, that, I never really hated anything. Before that, you had to take the board exam and all that stuff. So, uh, you know, how how come you, you like I all the I found it subjects? interesting. I like all subjects, right? Yeah, see, Ruby, you have to say it's like the other book one, that is all interesting and I can do it. You know, then I, this is your homework for... Uh, next week, okay. Let us uh, make you interest. Okay. So everybody's got the homework for next week. But yeah. before before you do that, what is the ultimate goal? What is the goal to for become more excellent? For your goal of your weakness and how they tie yeah. to the three goals. Think about that. You know. And then, yeah. then see how you're sincere to the goal of weakness is trying to. It does everybody. They put that. Is it okay to keep some weaknesses or try to eliminate weaknesses? It does. What do you think? Eliminate weaknesses. I think it's best to eliminate weaknesses so then you can be best. And because Dada Bhagwan did not have any weaknesses, you can be like him. And then you can, we can all reach the actual goal that we want to reach of becoming the partner person. So can you become wholesome without some weaknesses or you need to try to get rid of all your You need weaknesses? to try to get rid of it. Like you need to give your best shot at getting rid of them. Like getting rid of most of them is still good. It's better than not having, it's better than like not getting rid of half of them. Yeah. Yes. What is your one weakness? My weakness is I can't wake up early. Okay. And because you are not sensitive to waking up? Or because yes. so what is needed to be sincere to do that? Or you're not serious or you think it's okay, right? If you don't do that. Uh, you don't need to be sincere to have your weakness. Is it true? So is this good? No. How does it, how does it go to reach your goal? If you, the goal, the three goals we are always talking about, how are you going to reach that goal if you keep on doing that? What? If you keep on doing that, can you reach your goal? Yes. You can? Yes. Devam? No. Devam says no. If we keep our weaknesses, we can't reach our goal. Thank you, Devam. So, what, what do we, we are the taxi bar. So, we are thinking this is not sincere if you don't 
try to do something about the weakness, okay? So we need to focus on our big three goals, how the weaknesses match up this goal and try to eliminate that weakness, okay? Okay. Okay, Devita, do you want to say something? Yeah. Just imagine if you want to become a person like more excellent person like Dada Bhagwan, then how many weaknesses can you afford to have? With how many weaknesses None. you can become more excellent? Zero. Dada Bhagwan? None. 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 What do you think? None. No weaknesses. So that goal itself will make you aware and make you conscious. Not only that, you will be well focused and you'll be really working strongly against your weaknesses. So with that goal, naturally, practically you want zero weaknesses. Yeah. So you cannot afford any weakness. But those weaknesses will always keep pinching you and keep you alert all the time. Exactly. So, like we were talking earlier, remember, we have three goals. But each goal underneath is there are many, many, many goals underneath. And what yeah. we do every day to accomplish those goals, to reach the top goal, is very important. And that's where, what comes into picture? Kush? Um, Starts with an S. Like that, sweet. Could you repeat? What? I said, you know, we have three big goals, and each one, three goals, a lot of goals, and then yeah. we have everyday goals. So to yeah. reach the everyday goal, we have to complete everyday goal, then it will reach to the other goal, and then ultimately other goal, and like other goals. Yeah. And in order to yeah. do that, what do you have to be? Sincere. Sincere. Yeah. So how sincere are we in what we want to really achieve? That is very important. You know, we are always sincere when you want uh, something from parents. How sincere are you? Very, because you really want it. Try to get it from them. How sincere do you try? A lot. Push. How come? You do a lot. Because you really want it. You really reading. want it. So you keep telling them that give it to me. Why aren't you giving it to me? You try to persuade them to give it. Yeah. And reading and writing is not. What happens to them? Because it's less interesting. See, is, it, is it interesting? So, no, the real thing is not interesting. You do not want to get that. Yeah. And you don't have, haven't thought about the consequences of that like if you get something from parents how how long does it last not that long and maybe a year if you're lazy on your writing and studying or write, uh, reading what is the consequence of that on the long run well if you are not sincere then when you like grow up then you will have less chances of getting jobs like good jobs because you use what you learned. Don't focus only on job. Reading well, you won't write. know how to do things. If you have to cook and you didn't learn that, then you wouldn't know how to do that. Always go to the three goals. Don't talk about only, only search for work and money. You will not accomplish all these three goals. I am. You know, you may get money, but so what? Then you'll be, in the, you, you don't know how to be happy then. You'll be lazy after. Yeah, so okay. So please, okay. So 
So everybody got the homework? Yeah. Yeah, yeah but First thing you need to determine your goals and sincerity, and then work on the weakness. Okay? Anything else yeah. you want to do, Yeah. Okay. okay. Any other question? I don't know no. what. So, Hitesvi, are you going to see Hetsi? No, not today. Tomorrow? Probably next week, I okay. think. Okay. Then it's too bad. If you meet or talk. Please explain to me all this stuff. He's already online. I don't know why, yeah. why they, they are muted on the line. So the, there again goes the sincerity of coming to such Did you listen to all this? Is it, is it because your parents tell you to come? No, they were always coming. They were. You, they were. Yes. Does your mama tell you to be on the... Satsang or you automatically come? First mom attend the satsang and then she tell me to join and then actually I also join the satsang. By your and then or? I put in trust. Is it because she wants you to or you want to? No, I want to. Yeah, okay. I see you all the time. So at least at least you come, Kush comes, Ruby comes, the taxi bar comes, so yeah. You know? I also come in the other satsang. That's like at eleven thirty every day. Correct. Because I get my recess Correct. from school. Yeah. So I don't but know. I'm eating, so I don't keep my camera yeah. on. I don't know what you heard. Why you were offline? Um, or you, or I, you... I was I was listening. I was just in the car. Okay. Yeah, but in car you can always talk from car. But bo ava to to. Okay. So you heard everything. You know the homework. Yeah. What weakness are you going to work on? Um, I think I'm going to work on, you know, getting angry at my sister. Angry? Angry at my sister to stop doing that. No, angry with what? Hmm. Vishal, take this bottle. Your parents? Um, not parents, Kishali. I don't okay. get angry at parents. Why do you want to make that as a, your goal? <laughs> what did you say? Sorry? Why do you want to make that as a goal? Because I, I want to be a better sister. Okay. And we also thought about sincerity. So sincerity needs to come be fixed. Okay. Okay. Dhruvi, please do the three mantra. Namo Vitra Gai. Namo Vitra Gai. Namo Arihantanam. Namo Arihantanam. Namo Siddhanam. Namo Siddhanam. Namo Ayariyanam. Namo Ayariyanam. Namo Vazayanam. Namo Padvam Hawaii Mangalam. Padam Hawaii Mangalam. Mangalam. Om Namo Bhagwate Vasudevai. Om Namo Bhagwate Vasudevai. Om Namaskivai. Om Namaskivai. Jai Satchidana. Jai Satchidana. Jai Satchidana.